An incredible new discovery could help develop a broad coronavirus vaccine. Researchers at Scripps Institute found that this vaccine could cover more strains of the virus and could also help treat pa patients and prevent future pandemics. CBS 8's Abby Alford explains how a new study could develop a vaccine to fight the coronavirus and its variants. Scientists at Scripps Research have made a breakthrough in the process of developing a vaccine that can not only protect you from the coronavirus and its current variants, but future coronaviruses. Imagine if another pandemic were to hit and to already have a treatment. As we could stockpile these types of antibodies so that in case of an, a new pandemic uh, emerges, we could use them to treat People. Dr. Rais Andrabi is a Scripps Research Investigator of Immunology and Microbiology and a senior co-author of a study that identified the vulnerable site at the base of the spike protein on multiple coronaviruses that could be targeted to prevent future pandemics. It's fascinating. It does definitely give us a lot of leverage into how we can develop these broad coronavirus vaccines to tackle SARS-CoV-2 variants and, and, and potential future coronaviruses. In 2020, scientists previously isolated an antibody from a COVID-19 survivor that can neutralize other beta coronaviruses. Those include SARS-CoV-1, which killed 800 people, mostly in Asia, over a two-year period starting in 2002. Then there was the Middle East Respiratory Syndrome in 2012 that killed 900 people. So while there's not nearly as many deaths as the more than 5 million people who have died worldwide from SARS-CoV-2 or COVID-19, these are viruses that we remember and that could evolve and spread from animals to humans. The site that we have identified here will allow us to develop vaccines. Those will be effective even against those viruses. This is one very important breakthrough in a long process, but one that could better protect against COVID-19 and its variants, but also for doctors treating patients in a future pandemic. If we develop vaccines that could evoke those types of antibodies by vaccination, then we will have vaccines ahead of us ahead of the time so so that we are prepared for the next potential pandemic. Scientists say that they'll continue their research to identify broader coronaviruses, but it could take at least two years to develop a vaccine.